Salutations, Jones Nation. Welcome back to the show. And today, he is reviewing London Fields. And this movie has a zero on Rotten Tomatoes as of last time we checked. And that is this movie a zero. I know. I, I went into this movie. I said, hold it. It's got an interesting premise. The premise is that there's a beautiful femme fatale played by Amber Heard who, as soon as she meets a man, can tell... His future or her future, it's, it's a weird thing. When she falls in love, she knows instantly the two futures. So she suddenly starts to realize that she's going to die on her 30th birthday. And she knows she'll meet the man in a certain bar, but that's all she knows. And so the movie is following these three main characters that she meets. And so it's kind of an interesting premise. It's going to be long, lingering art shots of Amber Heard and some good actors so what was not the like so i went in to thinking everyone else is just being critical this is probably a good little art flick leave it alone let's have some fun and oh my goodness um amber heard delivers she's beautiful but some of the other characters were so distractingly weird or weird looking and including johnny depp and bizarre long sequences of playing darts darts wow um that i just kept gritting my teeth and saying no this could be good this could be good even as people got up and left the theater and then it got to the end and it was just bizarre unsatisfying whatever so in this case a zero in Rotten Tomatoes was actually deserved. Apparently, somebody, a studio, was paying Johnny Depp back on a favor and made a movie with his girlfriend, who, for looking beautiful on screen, she did. And apparently, the original novel it's based on is very was a very big seller. But apparently, not all best-selling movie uh, novels turn into good movies. So, we just saved you some money. So don't pay cash. Don't go see it with your movie subscription. Skip it. Don't even pay a dollar at Redbox. If it comes on cable. Uh, maybe. <laughs> Just watch watch the few scenes. We, watch Amber Heard and then shut it off before the end and make up your own ending. You'll feel much better about yourself. Yeah. So, But tell if you did see it or you've heard differently... Give us a comment down in the uh, comment section, or you can say thank you for us saving you money. You're welcome. There it is. That was our gift to you, our fellow brethren. Yeah, well, more of his gift. I, didn't even, I just skipped it completely. I did not help out. I had one last credit on my movie pass that I had to use, and it was showing at a theater I was near, so I went. And you uh, really went out with a dud. I know. I wanted to see it, though. It sounded like a good premise. Boy, did they trick me. <laughs> but and. in the future, you can follow us on the Jones Boys Review on both Instagram and Twitter. And after you follow us, when you get a Twitter, retweet it with your comment and post the link for the review. Exactly. And if you like this video, drop a like. And if you dislike this video, drop a dislike. Let us know why in the comments. And if you have never even heard of this movie or plan on seeing it or planned on seeing it, let us know in the comments. And until the next review, adios, nation. Adios.